Open Command Window here is a really cool tool that's been put out by Microsoft. Unfortunately, they don't have an upgraded version of it. It only works with XP. So if you got Windows XP, you can take advantage of this application. Now what it does is it allows you to go into a folder, into a command, a command line inside that folder, and it takes you right to it. Let me explain what that means. As a technician, you're going to need to get to the command line a lot to do some things with Windows. And what I mean by the command line is this. If I go over to Run and I type in CMD, I get what's called a command line. And I can do different commands here, see what's going on on my computer. I can change directories or what we call changing folders in uh, Windows. You, as you can see, I went back one level there. But let's say that I need to get into this folder here and I need to do something manually in this folder with the command line. Well, there's no easy way to get into it. What I have to do is I have to start the command line and then I have to say, okay, that's IT1 alphabet soup on my desktop. By default, the command line takes you to your account, whatever account you use to log in with on this computer, it's user. So I have to change the directory, which means to go into the folder called desktop. That gets me to the desktop of the computer. And then I got to change the directory or go into the folder called IT1 alphabet soup. Hey, looks easy enough, right? But let's say you've got folders embedded in folders all over the place. What a pain trying to get around. I mean, this is how we used to do it back in the 80s when we had something called DOS. We were very used to it, but we didn't have these long file names. We didn't have file names that were allowed to go over eight letters. And you know some folder names can get really big, so there's a lot of typing there. And I can do a DIR command here then, and there's all my files. If I need to do anything, move them, copy them, I can do it at that point. But again, you got to navigate there manually in the command line. Well, download the command line tool, the uh, open command, uh, command line here. You can find it on Web Campus or you can find it at Microsoft's website. And go ahead, once you got it downloaded, go ahead and install it. It's real easy to install. I already had it loaded once, that's why that came up. All right, here's the installer. Just go ahead and click on Next. You accept the terms. Next, next, you want to do the complete installation and install. And that's it, you're done. Now, you don't see anything different on the screen, but watch this. When I right click on anything, like say like a folder, now I've got this thing called open command window here. I click on that and I'm instantly there. I didn't have to navigate by hand. Really cool. Likewise, if I have the folder open, I can just right click up here and I can say open command window here and get to it as well. So whether the folder's open or closed, just right click on it and it'll take you right to the command prompt of that resource. A great way to get around inside of uh, Windows when you have to do things on the command line. Uh, open command window here, Power Toy from Microsoft. Really a cool tool, but again, it's only good for Windows XP.